Okay, so that you can see the line created by the, the marking gauge, um, I've used a pencil just to highlight the line. And you can see that what I've done is I've roughly cut, uh, using a bandsaw, um, some of the, I've removed some of the excess material away. You can see that this is not a particularly straight line. Um, but what I'm going to do now is I'm going to use a plane so that we um, remove this material and we work up to the line. So I'm just going to place it back into my jig, like so. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to plane up to the line. So, if you look now, you can see that the pencil line is just about to disappear. I've got a nice straight line, and that's the first stage of, of the leg. Okay, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to draw a line that runs down the centre. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to draw a line that runs down the centre of my leg and I'm going to need this line later on. So I'm measuring across my leg, which is 50 millimetres. I'm going to draw a point where 2.5 is. So I'm going to get my marking gauge. Let's start that again. Okay, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to create a line that runs down the centre of the leg. And so to do that, I'm going to set, I'm going to measure the distance of my leg, which in this case is 50. And I'm going to set the marking gauge to, in this case, 25 millimetres, which is half of the width of the wood. And then I'm going to draw a line. I'm going to draw the line that goes about the first third of the leg. If we think about one two, three thirds. This line is approximately on the first third of the leg. Okay. And what I'm going to do is just to make that line a little bit easier to see, I'm going to draw a pencil line there. What I'm now going to do is write the word top here because this is going to form the top of my leg and this is going to form the bottom of my leg here. 